What is going on everyone? This is Eric coming at you from just outside Hartford, Connecticut. And today we have a real quick trade breakdown. As you can see, only six players. And this is the Nelson Cruz trade, which occurred July 28th, 2006. And it's between the Texas Rangers and the Milwaukee Brewers. And it, it, it's a pretty much a, a good fleecing here. So the Texas Rangers would acquire outfielder slash designated hitter Nelson Cruz, alongside first baseman Carlos Lee from, from Milwaukee in exchange for a pair of outfielders in Lance Nix and Kevin Mensch, as well as a pair of relievers in Francisco Cordero, Cordero and Julian Cordero. So how did these guys do? Of course, we'll start with Texas, the team who gets Nelson Cruz. And Cruz had a solid 7.5 year stop in Texas. Uh, he really started, especially as this time went through, he started to grow as a power hitter. He started off as a little weaker, but he really started growing as time went on. And unfortunately for him, in August of 2013, he did get caught with PEDs. He received a 50-game PED suspension, and that kind of soured his relationship with the team. And he ends up walking after that season. But he was a two-time All-Star while in Texas, and Carlos Lee... He had a great, like a really good offensive season, half season, sorry. But defensively, he wasn't good. So he was a guy who they probably wanted to DH, but he was, they they couldn't justify it. And he ends up walking after that half season, so nothing really comes to him. But that's why they were able to get him, you know. He, he, he was a pretty good player in his prime. And Milwaukee, in return for these two players, only gets some okay players so lance Nix, he he spent most of his two and a half years in the organization as a minor leaguer he typically wasn't much more than a minor league bat anyway barely a bell of average barely average player i should say uh kevin minch he underachieved in one and a half seasons he was actually one of the bigger names that they got back in this trade and he just did not mesh well with the club uh francisco cordero he had a strong one and a half years in milwaukee he actually would make one all-star game, but then he would walk, and Julian Cordero never made the big leagues. So, all in all, like I said, pretty much a fleecing here. Texas gets a 13.0 war out of mostly Nelson Cruz and half season of Carlos Lee, while Milwaukee gets a eh, not that good 2.6 war, mostly again from one player, Francisco Cordero. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a great rest of your day.